Hi, hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Balakrishna. In this video, I am going to I am going to explain class 10 one more questions, real number chapter one. So first one, find the value of log root x base x. So here root means what the exponent form one by two. So here log root x base x you can write as log x power 1 by 2 base x so this one here x we can write as x power 1 so here 1 by 2 by 1 into log x base x so that is 1 by 2 into log of any number base of the same shall is 1 that is 1 by 2 find the value of find the value of log 0 0.001 base 10 so here log 0 0.001 base 10 after the point how many decimals are there three decimals you can write the zeros 1 by 1000 so base 10 so 1000 we can write as 10 cube 1 by 10 cube base 10 so 1 by 10 cube we can write as 10 power minus 3. Here you can use the loss of exponent form. a power minus n is equal 1 by a power n. So that is a log 10 power minus 3 base 10. So this one you can write as minus 3 into log 10 base 10. So here minus 3 into log 10 base 10 is how much? 1. So that is minus 3. Find the value of log 27 by a base 2 by 3. So here log 27 by a base 2 by 3. You can write as log 27. You can write as 3 cube. 28 we can write as 2 cube base 2 by 3. So this one you can write as log 3 by 2 over 4 3 base 2 by 3. So here a by b whole power minus m. You can write as b by a whole power m. So 3 by 2 whole power 3 you can write as log 2 by 3 whole power minus 3 base 2 by 3. So this one you can write as minus 3 into log 2 by 3 base 2 by 3. So log 2 by 3 base 2 by 3 value is how much? 1. So minus 3 into 1 that is equal to minus 3. Here you can use the formula log x power m base a. You can write as m log x base a. So find the value of 5 log 9 base 25. So here you can use the formula a log n a power log n base a can write as n. So here 5 log 9 base 25 you can write as 9 to the power of log 5 base 25. So 9 to the power of log 5 base 25 you can write as 5 square. 5 power you can write as 1. So that is a 9 power. 1 by 2 log 5 base 5. So here 9 power 1 by 2 into 1. 9 you can write as 3 square. 4 power 1 by 2. So that is 3 power 2 into 1 by 2. 2 to cancel that is 3. Here log x power m base x power m. You can write as m by m formula you can use here. So here a power m whole power m is equal a power m into m. This formula you can use here. Find SF of 36 and 48 by using Euclid division formula. So first, 48 is divided by 36. 36 one ja, 36. The remainder is 12. 12 is divided by 36. 12 three ja, 36. The remainder is 0. So Euclid division lemma. What is the Euclid division lemma? A is equal B into Q plus R. So the R condition is 0 less than R equal or less than B. So that is a 48 is equal 36 into 1 plus 12. Next, 36 is equal 12 into 3 plus 0. So where you can get the remainder 0? At divide at 12. So that is the HCF of 36 and 48 is 1. Next, express 3 by 8 into decimal form. 
into decimal form. So 3 by 8. How we can write? 3 by 8. We can write prime fraction 2 cube. So 2 cube is multiplied with which number it is become power of the 5. So uh, it is become power of the 10, 5 cube. So the numerator is multiplied with 5 cube, denominator is multiplied with 5 cube. That is 3 into 5 cube, 125 by 2 cube into 5 cube. So 125 into 3, 375 by 2 cube into 5 cube, 3 cube. So 375 by 1000. So 3 zeros, that means we can get 3 decimal, 0 0.375. So the decimal form of 3 by 8 is how much? 0 0.375. When you get the decimal form, the denominators are power of the 10 or power of the 2 or power of the 5 or both 2 and 5. Then we can get the decimal form. So, log 1.5, we can write as 5 to base 5. We can write as 3 into log 5 base 5. So, that is 3 into log 5 base 5, 1, that is 3. Next, simplify 2 log 5 plus 3 log 3. So this one you can write as 2 log 5. You can write as how you can write log 5 square. 3 log 3. You can write as log 3 cube. So log 5 square that is 25 log 3 cube that is 27. So log log x base a plus log y base a. You can write as log x into y that is here log 25 into 27. So here 25 into 27. 35, 175, 50. So that is log 620, 675. The exponent form of log root x by c a is equal to b. So this one you can write as root x is equal to a power b. This exponent form is here root x is equal to a power b. Next, the decimal form of 13 by 25. So 13 by 25. So 25 you can write as 5 square. Now 5 square is multiplied with which number you can get as power of the 10. So yeah, the denominator is power of the 10. The number is a decimal form. So that is here we can multiply 2 square. That is 13 into 2 square. 4. 5 square into 2 square. So 13, 4 is 52. 5 square into 2 square. 10 square. That is 52 by 10 square. 100, 2, 0. That means you can get 2 decimals. 0, 0.52. 5, Next, log 5 power base 8. So, 5 power you can add as 2 power 9. Base 8 you can add as 2 cube. So, this one you can add as 9 by 3. Log 2 base 2. So, 3 1 ja, 3 3 ja. 3 into log 2 base 2 value is how much? 1. So, 3 into 1, 3. Next, log 343 by 125. So, log x by y is equal to log x minus log y. So, that is at log 343 minus log 125. So log 343 we can write as 7 cube. Log 125 we can write as 5 cube. So this one we can write as 3 log 7 minus 3 log 5. So this is the exponent form. Find the value of log 64 base root 2. So 64 we can write as 2 power 6. Root 2 we can write as 2 power 1 by 2. That is 6 by 1 by 2 log 2 base 2. So, in the fraction, the denominator fraction is become this focus 6 into 2 by 1. Log 2 base 2 1. So, 6 to 12. Next, log 343. You can add as 7 cube. 49. You can add as 7 square. This one you can add as 3 by 2. Log 7 base 7. 3 by 2 into log 7 base 7. 1. That is 3 by 2. The value of 340, log 343 base 49 is how much? 3 by 2.